Minister Malcolm, you have suggested that there are all kinds of movements in Harlem growing that you and I don't know about? Oh, yes. Uh, frustration itself has been, has been sufficient. All that was necessary to make Negroes realize the, the importance of banding together. And Negroes are banding together. Banding together in what kind of movements? Uh, different kinds of movements. All kinds of movements. And, and they remain almost invisible. They remain almost unknown. But yet they are there. When I say invisible, I mean invisible in the sense that their existence is unknown. And no matter how much you try and track them down, you can't find them. out there doing time, you know what I mean? In jail or on the street. You don't gotta be in jail to be a prisoner. You don't gotta be in jail to be doing time. That's how we gonna do it. You in the hood right now, I want you to look around and ask yourself, are you free? Are you really free? <laughs> Pay attention, look. Go look. Now, you don't really wanna test this guy, and you don't really wanna stress this guy. Chicks, bless this guy, sex this guy. Even if the D's arrest this guy in the freshest ride, I'm more than able to floor these gray Jews in the hood like he legal cave, more than stable. Cats broke, that's why they hate Lou when they can make it, but too dumb to make moves. Hey, this is crazy, must think I'm lazy. This is see me on TV, you gotta pay me. Now, cops hate me, cause I'm all about something. And these rap cats all about nothing. Analyze it, what are they saying? Nothing. Nursery rats, still stunting, still fussing. When the hell y'all gonna get up and pill something? Youngins praise y'all and they ain't kill nothing. Make no mistake, I told the 38 skinny, but my Jews got me overweight. Hey, this new diamonds trick, don't get it confused. Half talk tough, but ain't spitting them tools. What I see through, all the fake is. Stop making excuses, even fiends can make shit. You broke, ain't paid child support, it's your fault. You a trick on the street, but now you gotta go to court. Life ain't a sport. It's a game and you can't fall. So I suggest you get on your grind if you wanna ball. Escape the lanes in the hood, up to no good. I'm a hustler, up to living like I should. For my people behind the walls I went to school with. I'm toting fours, aiming at haters, yours if they draw. Cops wanna knock me, cock block me. So I got a team of marksmen where they not be. Knuckle game rocky, only bullets can stop me Two piece in these pigs, till they nostrils bleed Fill a body up with lead, get the pump in case he jump Two cops, 7.30, one got shot, one got ox Threw him in the back of the truck So like 3 o'clock, we finish the chumps Leave him slump, now dump the V, lose the heat That's two bodies, to get it off our mind We hit a pool party, wow. east side And what form will the activities of these various so-called invisible movements take in all well, this summer? An example, uh, Commissioner Murphy. Almost every statement that Commissioner Murphy makes uh, would give you the impression that he's encouraging the police, rank and file policemen, that, uh, to take whatever method or measures necessary to hold the Negroes in check. Uh, he leaves the type of statistics to the white public to make them think that Harlem is a complete criminal area that everyone is prone toward violence. This gives the police the uh, impression that they can then go and brutalize the Negroes or suppress the Negroes or even frighten the Negroes. Whenever something happens, 20 police cars converge on one area. This doesn't frighten the Negroes. So it means that someone is either misinforming Commissioner Murphy and making him use tactics this year that he would not use four years ago or that the former police Kennedy would not use. And, and this uh, force that is so visible in the Harlem community creates a spirit of resentment in every Negro. They think they're living in a police state and they become hostile toward the policeman. They think that the policeman is there to be against them rather than to protect them. And these thoughts, these frustrations, these uh, apprehensions automatically are sufficient to make this, uh, make these Negroes begin to form means and ways to protect themselves in case the police themselves get too far out of line. Your ass is mine. No. Not yet, it ain't. Well, what have we here? You a good 
cop. Hot shot. <laughs> sure you are. Why, you gotta be some kind of great cop. Come in here all by yourself. Where's your partner? Where's your partner? <laughs> I bet that really pisses you off. <laughs> you probably don't think I'm a very nice guy, do you? Buddy, I think you're slime. See, I got this problem. The cops don't like me, so I don't like cops. <laughs> well, give the man a hand. <laughs> He's all yours. <laughs> all right, all right, look out. Turn around, man. Hey, straight boy. Hey, straight boy. <laughs> Get out of here.